Hello! Good afternoon, it's Monday the 29th of May and we have just touched down in San Francisco. We've just flown in today from Los Angeles. We got here into our hotel about 10 minutes ago. We're staying at the Handerley Hotel just at Union Square in San Francisco, but that means anything to shoot, doesn't to me. Um, yeah, already prefer San Francisco to LA. Are you the same? Yeah, the, so Yeah, the sun is shining, the hotel is nicer. Um, yeah, it's just nicer outside. I feel more safe outside, even though there is still a lot of what was going on in LA. Anyway, we're here, we're away to catch this little tram thing that is floating up and down the hills because San Francisco is so hilly. Already we've discovered that. Um, we're away to grab one of those trams to take us to Fisherman's Wharf where Lewis is desperate to try in and out Burger. And whilst the sun is shining, I think it's a lovely thing to do. So let's go and explore the tram in Fisherman's Wharf. So this is Union Square, this area. It's so beautiful and sunny. Our hotel, I don't know if you can see, it's just like three buildings, maybe two or three buildings just up there on the left hand side. This is the cable car things we're talking about. Look how hilly San Fran is. This is what we're just waiting for now. <laughs> how cool is that? And we're just waiting for it to come up here. We hope. Yeah. yeah. Here. Lovely day. It's a bit chilly. I've still got my hoodie and my denim jacket on. Loose is just in a t-shirt though. It's roasting. Are you roasting? I'm feeling absolutely Well you've just carried about 50 kilos in yeah, luggage up, yeah. <laughs> up that hill. We're on. Right, we're just off the tram. That was really cool. It was nice. Great fun. Yeah, it was, it was Different cool. way to travel. This little boy got on and sat next to us and his mum said, well Lewis got up so he could sit and he was about three or four, probably about four and his mum said, well introduce yourself and he said his name and then we said, we're Rhiannon and Lewis and he said our names better yeah. than we could ever. He was like, well hello Rhiannon and Lewis and he just kept coming in for bosies. Did yeah, you see I've it? That, yeah. It was so cute. But then this, other, this old, old elderly lady was like, he's so beautiful will get all the girls and I was like yeah it's beautiful eyelashes I think she thinks that was my kid oh, yeah. <laughs> it was so oh anyway he was Probably, so I'll cute we're heading to in and out burger and I'm so hungry I could run there um yeah we'll see you in and out burger right we're at the famous in and out burger I think it's around the corner it's much colder and windier in San Francisco than it is in LA that's for sure. There we go. Let's go and eat some burgers. We're in a night burger. We've got a cola, a Dr. Pepper, some pickled peppers, I think they are pickled jello peppers, sauce, and we've ordered two. Two double double burgers. So it's double patties, double cheese, and we've got onions on them. Yeah, we ordered with onions, and it looks like really nice salad. Doesn't it? It looks better than a Big Mac. Oh, yeah. We'll wait and see what happens. I'm so hungry. It's chocolate in here, isn't it? Yeah, How busy is it? Chaos. We're lucky to get a table. Right, it's here. The Big Burger. Oh, it smells delicious. Oh, and chips. Yum. Um, we'll feed back and let you know how it is. I'll feed and then I'll get back. <laughs> looks awesome. <laughs> We could not vlog in there because we were too hungry, but that was incredible. Like the best burger. Yeah? 
Hi. Hi, David. <laughs> um, <laughs> that was so nice. Um, probably the, my most favourite fast food burger ever. I said that about Shake Shack, but that beats Shake Shack for me. Yeah, Ree thinks it beats Shake Shack. I still think Shake Shack is on top. It was a very good burger. I would give that a 9 out of 10. 9 out of 10? Yeah. 11 out of 10. Yeah, because that's a real score. The chips, though, weren't good. I didn't like the chips. She did. I tucked away at them. I, I mean, say, I ate I would them say because they were bang average, to be honest. But bang average is enough for me to scoff them. So well, anything fried, I'll eat. So mm. yeah, very Taking average away chips. Taking Dr Pepper. Yeah, I've got a Dr Pepper. Which is another bonus. Squeezy um, Dr Pepper is pretty good. Yeah, it's nice. Oh, there's a sweetie shot. Mm. That's cool. You don't need any of your sweet enough. Oh, thanks, darling. You're welcome. Anyway, we're going to go and explore Fisherman's Wharf. I think there's like an area where there's like loads of sea lions. Yeah, there's like a sea lion viewing area. And one thing we've done really well since getting to San Fran is walking in the only bit of shade. So <laughs> let's cross the road. Yeah, let's get in the sun. Yeah, get in the sun. Go on then. So there's a boat there that said it's going to Alcatraz for $20 and it's an hour long boat cruise. The, uh, the Golden Gate Bridge, which is cool. Um, yeah, there's just other boats down here. We've got great weather. Yeah, it's very nice. Um, and then there's just like little tourist shops. Yeah, like tourist souvenir, sh shops. souvenir shops. Yeah. Um, yeah, it's not too busy down here, is it? No, it's fine. It's all right. I'm not out of everyone, that's okay. Fisherman's Wharf, will we go down here, Lou? Got some music there and some little bars. Wow. The crab station. Where? Oh, the tider hut. I bet there's loads of brilliant places. I know. I know, thank you. Wow. Loads of seafood restaurants down here. Oh, wow. It smells amazing. Just eating crab back there. It looks really good. What else have we got? Altitos. Oh, the seafood smells amazing. I've never had chowder and I've never had Cullen skink in my life and I'm a bit of a seafoodie foodie. So in in there you get a big bowl of uh, sourdough bread and they fill it with chowder. That's cool. Yeah. And we thought by the way we just wanted to save this for the last leg to get used to the seagulls again before we go home. <laughs> so that's us. Look at the view out there. Is that how we're getting to Alcatraz? Down here? Probably, yeah. Yes. We've just crossed the road and there's Alcatraz itself. So it used to be an old prison on a deserted island. I don't know anything more than that yet, but when we go tomorrow, I'll let you know. But that's awesome. Look at that view, Lewis. Yeah. A wonderful view. Oh, I hope the weather's like this tomorrow when we go. That would be ideal. Please. 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 And there's an Applebee's over there, which is nice. Oh, we find a little lock bridge. Me and Luce have never done this before. Master and master. Maybe. Sixth of, um, yeah. Sixth of October, probably. Yeah. Two thousand and twelve. <laughs> oh, cool! I love that kind of thing. Imagine we did this, and then Mum and Dad could come and find it when they're here. Yeah, we'll send them on a hunt. Yeah. Travel. Oh, that would be cute. Oh, lovely views. So this man is making some kettle corn. Yeah. And we've got a little mixed bag of salted and sweet for $5. Well, 
but we got the bottom of his pile, didn't we? So we probably got all the... Got the scraps and the dregs, Luke. The scraps and the dregs. Anyway, I hate when they do that at the cinema. I'm going to tuck into this popcorn because I've not had popcorn on this trip yet. We didn't get any in Universal, did we? No. Oh, yummy. He gave me he gave me a free sample. I should also point out that he thought we were Dutch. And then when we told him we're from Scotland, he asked, what city? Newcastle. Yeah. Uh, no. Morning. <laughs> it's still going down a treat. It's nice and warm. I'm glad we got this from that guy because this is hot and warm. Yeah. I'm um, so I make it. Whereas that will that would be hot. Like the battle has got caramel. Ooh. Anyway, we're on Pier 39 and we're heading down to see the sea lions. Yeah. Uh, they said um, an expensive fish restaurant, Fog Harbour Fish House, I think. We didn't go back. We didn't go back there. No, so it then. this place that we said that's the one, that's the one to avoid. Oh, it's expensive, but they wouldn't go back. What there was somewhere called Oyster and Co. or something. Yep, let's have a look. So, guys, look at our view now. We've got the sea lions just down here. There's one in the water. One in the water, where? One just chilling in the water down here. Hello pal, I'm Lou. Aww. And then the views up here, and I'll swipe round, we've got the Golden Gate Bridge in the distance over there. Lovely views of San Fran and then Alcatraz has already shown you up to the right. We're actually thinking of going to see the Golden Gate Bridge, aren't we, today? We are. We were thinking about it because it's so clear. And I think the weather can take a drastic turn here and go really foggy. Yeah, so then you can't even see the bridge sometimes, so that's a tip for you. If you see the bridge and you get the chance, just go and get your photos. And then you don't have to worry about it the rest of the whole day. Oh my god, look at all those sea lions there. Mark, Mark, Mark? Oh no. Sorry, that's um, Finding Nemo. I've got that all wrong. Why are they having a wee smooch? They're fighting. They're, they're actually massive. They're huge. Look at this one sitting on a shoulder for everyone. Yeah. Little, little flirt. You minx. That's cute. They want to wait to just roll into the water. Aww. Oh, it stopped. That's amazing. Right, it's just about 10 to 4 now. We've just put tickets for $130 for the two of us to do the big bus tour, the sightseeing tour, because that's going to take us over to the bridge and it'll take us through Chinatown, Lombard Street and stuff. But we're just on a different pier. We've got the Hard Rock Cafe. We've got some music. We've got Bubba Gums down there. We're just going to head into the rock shop. Um, but yeah, it's nice down here. I really like it. Can we get in these doors? Yeah. But yeah, it's cool. This is what I came in for. I saw one in LA, but I'm actually kind of glad that we've waited for the San Francisco. Yeah, because I prefer this because I actually prefer San Fran. So I think we're going to pick that up. $15.50. That's cute. And then they've got like the first t-shirts as well. That's nice. How cute. We're back on a bus. <laughs> Our favourite thing. How much have we spent on buses on this one? Oh my holiday? god. Hundreds. Hundreds. We've not done one in I know. Well, there's our bus. Oh yeah. Maybe not. Anyway, this is the company of the big bus tours, which we normally use in cities that we go to, isn't it? Mm -hmm. um, and we're just getting on at Fisherman's Wharf. Stop number one. We're kind of just using this to take us well around everywhere but we're only going to hop off the Golden Gate Bridge. We've only got like three buses behind us because obviously... The last bus was on for five and it's currently at four. It's 20 past four. It's 20 past four and the last bus is at five so we haven't got that many behind us but we'll make the most of it. We will, yeah. Don't leave me hanging. <laughs>
we've just been warned that this is our last stop before crossing the Golden Gate Bridge so once we leave this stop we can't go downstairs and be inside because it's really windy and cold. Here we go. We're ready. I'll get my goggles on. Eye <laughs> protection. Get the get your safety glasses on. <laughs> safety glasses. They're actually the smallest glasses I own. <laughs> They're not very safety at all, are they? No. <laughs> Hopefully at least the sun's out and that'll help a little bit. I don't know Lewis, it's freezing already. Yeah, well, we've not been in the sun for about an hour now. <laughs> Good evening. It is quarter to nine. We basically just got off the bus tour, jumped back onto the tram, which is $13 a day, isn't it? Mm -hmm. On on an app. What's the app called? Minu? Muni. Muni. M-U-N-I. M-U-N-I. So you download the app and you can get tickets that way. Um, thirteen dollars a day. We definitely didn't get thirteen dollars worth out of it today, but we yes, did. Yes, it did. It's eight dollars for a single fare. Oh, is it? We just spent sixteen if we just oh, okay. bought singles. God, that is quite expensive. But the hills here, you ain't climbing them. You're gonna get on that tram. Let me promise you. Um, yes, yeah, so the tram was fab. The bus tour was great. We love a bus tour, and I am shivering <laughs> we've been home for like an hour now and i'm still freezing um the bus tour was fantastic i did not expect to love golden gate bridge as much as i did it was one of the most beautiful things i have ever seen in my whole life but freezing so so cold even on the bus um but i do actually want to go back i'm trying to persuade lewis to try and find some bikes and cycle over i would love to do that today's been great in a night burger fantastic tomorrow we've got big plans and i'm definitely we're going to eat down at fisherman's wharf aren't we we are oh my god i'm so cold i'm actually so cold we're going to have like some fishy stuff down there tomorrow lewis doesn't eat seafood if there is one thing i could change about lewis and i say this all the time is that he ate fish he eats like haddock which is really fishy from a chipper and they eat quite a few other fish things as well. Yeah, the odd thing, but not. He's not really. Cod, scumpy, scallops. You're not in. Yeah, you're not into. I mean, shellfish then. Okay, yeah. Or can, salmon. Can have that one. Yeah, we will catch you first thing in the morning. I'm going for a hot shower and I am going to sit in the shower and I am going to be there forever. I'll give you a quick room tour now. So this is nice. We have got this little bedside table. We have got this massive bed. It's actually a huge bed. Okay. Lewis has a little table actually at the side. We've got a big walk-in wardrobe, isn't it? With an ironing board yeah, and stuff. Yeah, I wouldn't call it a walk-in wardrobe. Really. Well, it looked like a big walk-in cupboard. Yeah, cupboard is what I would call it. Yeah. yeah. It's just a big cupboard. We have got the bathroom in there, which is quite old-fashioned and really, really small. And then this way, these are the windows. Um a little dresser tv and so much floor space i just have it in me to get out of this bed at the moment um but yeah really happy with the room so much happier 
with San Francisco than I am LA. Like I, I just feel like a sense of relief being in San Fran. But LA is warmer. <laughs> LA is so much warmer than San Fran. It is so cold here. Um, even though it's sunnier, today was the sunniest. So I don't, I don't know what that was about. But we will catch you first thing tomorrow morning with our big plans for tomorrow. Good night.